North Korea ringing in the new year with an ominous development in his annual New Year's speech. North Korean leader Kim Jong Un suggesting that the regime is in the final stages of testing an intercontinental ballistic missile on ICBM, marking a potential breakthrough in Pyongyang's weapons program. Elizabeth Pran is following the story for us out of Washington. Elizabeth. Hi, Greg. Well, in his annual New Year's address, North Korean leader Kim Jong Un has now hinted to both North Korea and the world that his country is close to testing an intercontinental ballistic missile and that these tests have, quote, reached the final stage. Research and development of cutting edge weapons has become active, and the intercontinental rocket missile test fire preparation got to the final stages. Now, Kim did not explicitly say whether these tests were imminent, but he has a birth date on January 8th. Last year, Pyongyang conducted a nuclear test on January 6th. In 2016, the communist nation reportedly carried out nuclear tests while conducting up to 20 ballistic missile tests in that time period alone, setting an annual record. South Korea's unification ministry said in a statement that it, quote, strongly condemns Kim's threat to proceed with a test launch. It goes on to say the international community will not tolerate his efforts to develop nuclear weapons and threatens tougher sanctions and additional international pressures. South Korean diplomat and former U.N. Secretary Ban Ki-moon expressed deep concerns as well. I'm deeply concerned about that the news that North Korea is continuing to provoke the international community by testing ballistic missiles. United Nations has already taken five sanction measures. It is important that all international community members should fully cooperate so that these sanction measures will be fully implemented. North Korea has been under U.N. sanctions since 2006 over its nuclear tests, and sanctions were increased at the end of 2016 after its very large tests back in September. Greg, back to you. Elizabeth Pran in Washington. Elizabeth, thanks. Let's